Hey, what's everybody? Dr. Lega Nation here, and today we are back with yet another Series 2 Minecraft review. And today we're going to be reviewing an overworld Steve and Horse fully articulated action figure. I picked this up at Target for about $15, and, well, I think it's well worth it. Now, looking up at the front of the box, it's a little different because it's a value pack, so it is $5 more, but with the dirt block border, instead of the back, like everything else being the dirt block, it's actually the sky with the grass. So I think that was a cool thing. This does come with the Steve action figure, along with a horse, which this is the only set you can get that guy in, and it does come with an apple and a hail. Uh, <laughs> A hay bale or just hay block. Anyway, um, coming back to the back of the box, it is a little bit bigger and it shows Steve on the horse running with an apple in his hand. It would be a little cooler if it came with uh, maybe a couple fences or something, but hey. Um, and it does show the information here again and six and up, so let's go ahead and open the box. Alright, moving on to the guys, we're going to go ahead and take a look at just the Steve figure. Um, he is actually a little shorter than his um, diamond self, but like I reviewed to the last guy, the link will be down in the description if you want to go watch that review. Um, anyway, this guy, he is just a regular Steve with no armor on. Um, his articulation is like everyone else. He can move his head. His head can come off. Um, his arm moves 360 degrees. His arm can come off as well. If I put it back on. His waist, however, is a little hard to move at first, but he can move it. And his legs move like they can. And he can, however, hold the apple, but he has to hold it like this. Um, he cannot hold it any other way. So, that is Steve. Oops, gotta let it focus again. Um, here is a closer look at the apple. It's a lot redder than my camera is showing, but that's just because of the lighting. Um, here is the hay, the hay block. It is very standard. It's just like every other block. Same size, but just different printing on it. The bottom actually does look like hay. Anyway, moving on to the horse, which is the main part of this set. Its tail can move up and down, and this guy has so much more articulation than everybody really expected it to. Um, his knees can move, so he's actually, he can go like, hey! So that is really cool. His head can move up and down, and it, all of his legs can move about 90 degrees, and so can his, uh, that, and he can be going like that and still stand still. Now, the coolest part of, that they did with this set is that you can actually, with a little bit of force, you can take off his saddle. His saddle, so he looks like a wild horse. And then you can slide those two um, easily back on. And all you have to do is get Steve and slide him in there. And moving him up, you can make him ride on the horse. So, all in all, I think this set is actually a really, really good way to have Season 2. Um, to have Season 2. Honestly, this is one of my more favorite sets, and really... Any figure can ride on him, so um, I really hope that they come, they can come with some horse. Well, apparently, Mr. Diamond Steve, Mr. Diamond Steve can. 
but I really do hope that they come out with some horse armor and maybe come out with uh, him with Steve with armor on rather than diamond. So anyway, I think that this was a really cool set and all in all, I do suggest you go pick it up. You can again find this at Target, Toys R Us, or anywhere else. Anyway, this was a great review, and remember to like, comment, and subscribe, and if you want to go see more Minecraft videos, remember to like this video and go check out the link below to check out my previous Minecraft reviews. Alright, bye guys.